Why, hello there everyone, I'm the Kumo Sensei, and uh, welcome back, and I have something very interesting to ask everybody. What do you think about personal hygiene and live concert performances? Huh? And I know that sounds kind of strange, but uh, allow me to show you the article and then we'll just get straight into it, because I find this to be kind of goofy and funny, but also uh, understandable to an extent, I guess. But let's go. Alright, I'm just gonna get straight to the point. Rie Takahashi tells fans to bathe before her concert. This article is written by Kim Morrissey, so there goes credit where credit is due. And let us read this. Anime conventions and concerts have been known to be smelly. Oh boy. This is... <laughs> this is such a strange... <laughs> this statement is so strange to me, honestly, but let us continue. Voice actress and singer Rie Takahashi, Mash Light in Fate's Grand Order, Emilia and ReZero, Megumin and Konosuba held her first concert last Sunday, an exciting occasion to be sure. To prepare her fans for the event, she drew a charming infographic filled with tips on what to do. Oh boy guys, this is where, this is where it gets kind of goofy to me. Amusingly, her guide was filled with very obvious tips like don't forget to bring your wallet and make sure you wash your body beforehand so that you don't bother others with your odor. <laughs> God. God dang, this is just so goofy, man. And this is her post on Twitter, guys. Just, you know, just going over the basic stuff such as personal hygiene, like taking a bath here and whatnot. This is so goofy to me. Oh my gosh, I can't believe she... <laughs> like, this is so extra, almost. I believe she actually hand-drew and handwritten all of this here, which is why I find this to be so funny. But let us continue. It's hard to be mad at Takahashi, though. The overall impression of her infographic is one of careful thoroughness. She was particularly diligent with her health tips, like wearing a mask properly or bringing earplugs if you're worried about damage to your ears. She also drew cute illustrations. It's easy to feel Takahashi's affections for her fans. For their part, the fans took the advice in good faith. Thank you so much. I'll be sure to follow these tips was the most common response. Another person commented that arranging everything into one neat summary is helpful for first-time concert goers. Even the fans who noticed the take a bath point said they'll make sure to watch thoroughly. Although others said they laughed at seeing it explicitly pointed out like this. Anime conventions and concerts have known to be smelly. On Japanese Twitter, there have been PSAs telling people to shower before comic hits, or at least come up with some other way to mask body odor. So even if Takahashi's advice might seem obvious to many people, there are definitely people out there who need to hear it. And the article pretty much ends here. But yeah, I find this to be so cute and so funny. And there's a small group of people who think this is offensive to tell people to shower and about their body odors and whatnot. To me, this is nothing more than to have good hygiene. Like, come on guys, there's nothing technically wrong here. Good hygiene is really important and staying safe and making sure you have, you know, everything ready, such as these illustrations and whatnot that tells you to, it's fine with me, honestly. And I don't know if you've ever been to an anime convention before or ever been to any sort of live concert. There is a lot of body odor going around, both good and bad. It's a mix of everything. So it's understandable to see this, to be honest, like good hygiene and whatnot. <laughs> and I've... I find this to be more of cute than anything else. But yeah, guys, Ria Takahashi, though, for her to go the extra mile here to, <laughs> to put out these steps is just so cute to me. And with that, everyone, I'm the Kumo Sensei. I upload every single day. I do daily amazing uploads. So please feel free to like, comment, and subscribe and stay updated to whenever I upload here on the channel. I upload anything I find interesting, so please feel free to do so. And also, follow me on my IG and my Twitter to stay updated to what I do in my personal life and whatnot. And also stop by and join us on the Discord, everybody, because we're still growing up there as well, so please feel free to do so. And also, stop by whenever I live stream. I live stream anytime between 2 p.m. to 4 p.m. United States Eastern Time. And with that, that's really about it. See you.